you ever been to the top of the universe? <laughs> What's happening, fam? Um, LAR movement still moving. Subscribe or die trying. You see the thumbnail. Um, wow. Uh, she chose her son over her man. So there's a video about guy. You know, who's playing stepdad and, and and with the mom on the phone and. She's like, the stepdad is like, he got to go. This, your son got to go. Mom, like, that's my only son. That's my only child. He ain't got to go nowhere. Guy's like 29 years old. He says, I don't even be here. I don't even live here. Why I got to pay a bill or take out the trash or wash a dish? I don't even hardly be here. You So, in essence, you don't hardly be there. But you live there and you don't pay a bill there. So, where are you? Well, who house you bumming it at? What you doing with your money? Well, how come you can't afford a place? If you, because if you not, if you're not there really, but you there, and you you always got a place to come back to. Well, so you 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 a homosexual with a home? That's ridiculous. That's just my assumption. The guy who playing stepdaddy. Why you ain't leave? She chose her son over you, man. Like she she said she can get another you. She can't get you know she can't get another son. So. Let her, you know, date her son or marry her son. Like, because they said in the video, like, yo, you want him to go, but the woman you would got you from your mama house. So, like, really? Now you know what it looks like. <laughs> like, you. Yeah, she chose her son over you. You moved into her house when you was living with your mom before you met her. That ain't, I mean, you should have known that some disrespect was going to come somewhere along that way, right? Um, the, 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 the mother, like, okay. I don't know who you think going to want you, but if you, if a guy moves into your house and helps you, he can't help you with your kid, but, you know, but he's paying the bills in your house and you get an attitude with him. So you, obviously you've been saving your money while he's been paying the bills in your house, but it's still your house. You know, if I was him, I, you know, I, I bail on you and let you see if you can find another man. Because your son who don't want to work and don't want to chip in, let's see when you start getting on his neck, if he disappeared and go live with a woman just like you for a place to stay which he probably will because you're going to want something from him and that's not what he's trying to do. He's trying to be what the stepdaddy is, you know, at, so he thinks. But she chose her son over her man, and that's and that's her choice, you know. But, and, and you hear people complain all the time how, um, not, not all the time, but how, you met some people are mad at their mom because their mom chose their boyfriend or man over them. It's like, let me tell you what the problem with that is. This is what happens when you have kids before marriage. <laughs> That's what happens. You know, now your parents ain't supposed to have an adult life until you become grown because you're the priority. But I even, you know, but while you're a preteen, a teen, and a young adult, you're trying to meet and talk to somebody else too, but they got to wait until you, you get up and leave to do it, but you're doing it right in front of their face or you're trying to hide it from them, which is stupid. You know, they like them more than they like me. You you like your little boyfriend or girlfriend more than you like your, your mama anyway. So, you know, for you mothers out there, y'all stupid in the first place because <clears throat> y'all should know this about your kid. You know, but you chose your son over your man, and I promise you, your son going to leave you. He going to leave you for a woman. There's no doubt about it. And then what you going to have? Nothing. Now, to be 28, 29 years old and be comfortable with living with living in your, your mom's house that your quote-unquote stepdad is paying for, and, and you just walking around like it's all good, you, 
you're a failure at life. You never wanted to do anything with your life. And frankly, your mama raised you that way to be a, to be a, a failure because she's comfortable with that. So you might want not want to take this into consideration, but maybe you were raised to be a loser on purpose so she can always have a boyfriend and you and your sucker behind fell for it because you you never wanted to be a man and stand on your own two feet as is. So that is what it is. That that's a you problem. Um <clears throat> what also intrigued me about this whole thing was So if this man leaves and gets another woman, are you going to say you, you dealt with trauma and it was toxic, this, that, and the third? Or can he go around using that excuse? Or can the, the grown-up kid go around using the excuse that, oh, I left my mama house because it's toxic because my stepdaddy said I got to leave because I don't do nothing. and I, Like, that is so doggone stupid. But when you choose your son over your man, you wind up in these situations because at the end of the day, you're supposed to raise a child to be an adult, productive adult. Now, if they and you let this one not be a productive adult and enable them to continue continuously be that. And the reason I say it's a problem, <clears throat> you chose your son over your man. Here's the thing. Naturally, you're going to die before your child does. It's naturally. That's how it works. A parent normally dies before the child. So, when you choose your son over your man and your man and your son is grown, you're going to have to die until he be able to move on. And then he won't be able to move on nine times out of ten because you're the only person he quote unquote has. So, you sabotage not only his present day, but his future. Which is selfish in my opinion, but and, and the sons are too much of a sucker to realize, yo, I'm not going to have a life like this because I want to have a, I want to be in my twin size bed until I'm 45, but I'm a man. Like, you dumb. But tell me what you think. Like, share, subscribe, or die. Try and catch you on the next one. Peace.